Hello, this is Professor Sampson, and today we are going to learn how to find the LCM, the least common multiple, or least common denominator on your TI-84 plus calculator. The first step in finding that is that you need to go to math. Once you go to math, you'll see the num key. You have to scroll over, arrow over here to go to the num key. Then after you go to num, you go down, you can click down until you see LCM, which is number eight. Now you can just hit number eight. We'll do that in the next example. Hit enter. Then you put in your two numbers, but you have to separate the two numbers with a comma. So for example, if I was going to try to find the least common multiple, the LCM of four, and six, I need to put a comma in between the two. So that's four comma on top of the seven, six, and close my parentheses. Hit enter, of course, to tell the computer, the calculator that you wanna calculate it, and then you get the LCM of 12. So let's repeat that step again. You hit math, you go over to num, and that was number eight. So you can just hit eight to avoid scrolling down to eight. Hit the number eight, put in your two numbers. This time we can do five, comma. Don't forget the comma or you're going to get an error. Five, comma, 17, close parenthesis, and hit enter. And the calculator will give you your LCM. So that's if you're going to do the LCM with two numbers. What if you wanted to do the LCM using three numbers? For example, if you wanted to find the LCM between four, six, and 14, all right? You still go over to math, hit num again, and it's still number eight because you're trying to find the LCM. But you're going to put in your first two numbers as before, which in this case, I'm going to use the same two numbers from the top, four comma six so you can get used to that. Close your parentheses. Hit enter and that's 12. Now the third number that I wanna find it, I said four, six, and 14. So four, six, and 14. So I did four and six, and now I'm going to take the number, the LCM that comes up with four and six, and do that number with 14. So I'm going to go back to math, over to num, number eight, I'm going to Take the 12, please don't clear your calculator after each step. So I'm going to take the 12 now, comma, and then I'm going to use 12 and 14. So your final answer on your test is going to be the final answer after you did four, six, and 14, which is 84. And that concludes the video on finding the LCM. This is Professor Sampson, thank you for watching.